All right, what's up, class? Um, so after playing the Stanley Parable again, to me, the goals became kind of fuzzy. It really feels like you can make it whatever you have. You can make the game feel however you want it to feel. Um, you can follow the narrator's directions, but I feel you're supposed to disobey him because he's telling you what you're what you what to do, and you're faced with these different options, these these different choices, and different ways you can go. Um, to I I think it was the creator's idea to really make the game something where you disobey the narrator to find out all of the different unique outcomes of the game. Um, so at the end of it, the objection for me really shifted from finding out why Stanley was there to what are all the different outcomes that are there in the game um, to make the game end. Because it can really go on for a while if you want it to. Uh, I definitely found three, four different options that were unique in a way that I've never never played a video game before. Um, and the way the choices a player makes for sure affect how the outcome of the game is played for the player. Because the choices you make from choosing either the left or the right door, for instance, change every decision there on in the game. Um, I would like to design a game based on narrative. I haven't I haven't had a, a ton of time to dive deep into the details, but I want it to be based on narrative because the story for me is what interested me and got me into video games and would keep me going back for more. Um, I would also include parts of action and adventure as well as puzzles to keep your mind interested in the game and keep you wanting to play more. I'd like it to be somewhere between like Zelda, Skyrim, and Fallout 3. Might be tough, but I think it's possible. Um, yeah. Thanks.